Hey, what's good guys? This is Wood from Wood Cycles. And today we have a new chain ring. And uh, this is the Renthal Retaining Chain Ring Series. Uh, they call it 1 by R or 1 times R as well. This is 96 BCD and 34T. Planning to put this on my um, mountain bike that has a Dior group set. Um, it's 11 speed. Ano siya? Ang gearing niya is 32 yung chain ring, 32T. And then the cassette or cogs, it has 11 to 50. And the um, reason I'm putting this on my mountain bike is para somehow mas mabilis on tip sa flat. So, ay, um, may improvement lang. Pero, may, may mas deeper reason pa uh, for changing. It's because, my God, this is obviously naman ang ganda ng <laughs> chain ring na to. So, this is from Rental. It has alternating 1.8 and 3.5 mil with teeth. So, siguro ito yung 1.8, ito yung 3.5. Obviously. So, tabahin sa. Then, mud clearance and wearproof profiling. CNC machine, 7075T6 aluminum. So, yan yung material niya. Hard anodized surface, this one. Yan. Pag nagka-wear na rin siya, ma makikita rin yung... Kasi parang coating lang siya eh. Yung surface finish niya. Mud. We have mud grooves in the tooth bed. I guess this is the... Ito siguro. Mud grooves. Ayan. Ayan. Okay. What else? Ultra stiff I-beam cross section. Ah. Uh, hindi ko alam saan yan. Basta. Again, this is 96 BCD. Make sure when you when you replace your chain ring, kunin nyo yung tamang BCD. This is um, compatibility 9, 10, 11, 12 speed. Okay, aluminum weight is 35 grams at 30T. So, most likely ito ay more than 35 dahil 34T siya. Wearproof profiling. Ah, ayan pala siya. Mud grooves in the feet bed. I beam cross section. Siyempre, di natin siya makita. This is made in UK. Wow. Alright, now let's put this baby on my mountain bike. So, as you can see, we're back here in my room. This is the Dior M5100 uh, model intended for mountain bike. And it's 11 speed. And this is the 32 teeth um, chain ring. So here it says 11 speed or 10 speed 32 T. And so unlike the its sibling yung 6100 mas maganda yung tsura nun uh, mas parang aggressive yung styling but this is okay but you know mas maganda pa rin syempre ipapalit natin diba bam so let's get on to it Okay, what are the things that we need um, for this assembly? For what are the tools? Meron tayong spanner for um, chain ring bolts there. Kung applicable to. Then we have the thread locker. And in purpose nito, this is for making your bolts or yung nuts magstick dun sa finofuse yung um, parts like for ex for example the crank arm papunta dito sa chain ring so and it will be easier to disassemble then pag merong ganito okay so this is a local brand lang from Hardex this is we have of course our hex wrenches Ayan, Allen, screws, or whatever you call it. Basta. 
ito ang pampakalas ng mga bolts and nuts so let's start so kalasin muna natin yung chain because it might get in the way of things yeah. so plan ko is not to remove the crank whole crank set parang kalasin lang yung arm dito from this side so hopefully mag work siya but I'm not sure napakalaki ng ng ano ko ng pedal hindi natin lang magkakasya but let's try that method but if that won't work siguro tanggalin na natin Let's start at the bottom muna. And locking it in. Not too tight. Mamaya na natin tatighten lahat ng sides. Let's just make sure na maayos lang yung pagkakapwesto niya. Okay. So, ito na siya, final uh, product. Medyo madumi yung chain ko. Pagpasensya nyo na, but yeah, it would have wears naman eventually. Pag gamit na gamit na. Hindi naman to display, but tinan natin performance. Ganda. Color slightly parang faded gold. And bumagay siya sa bike ko, which is uh, army green. Diba? Lines of which we cry 
guys that's it for the unboxing and installation of the rental retaining chain ring or 1xr and again this is 96 bcd for the dior 5100 m5100 11 speed i don't know for other models but i think they have 104 or 105 but but depende uh, 94 is for SRAM, um, but again, this is for Shimano, and it's 96 BCD, 34T, or 34T, and um, natone ako na siya with my Sunrays cassette or cogs, and um, hopefully, mag-perform naman siya to what is expected with this price point na medyo mahal para sa so changing, which is I think quality naman, and in fact, this is made in UK. So, tiwala naman tayo dyan. This is not a generic or cheapo brand out there. Um, so, hopefully mag-live up siya sa price point niya at sa expected performance. Alright guys, that's it for our quick unboxing and quick overview and review of this product. Uh, please don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Again, my name is Wood and I'm from Wood Cycles. Thank you.